And hey everybody, today we're over here at the Fulton's General Store, located in the Port Orleans Riverside Resort. Over here you guys are looking at the River Roost, which is actually a bar slash lounge. It's a nice place if you just, usually people go in there to kill time before they leave, or when you're just hanging out at the resort. But as you're walking in the store, as you guys see, it's wide open. They got the Disney 100 years right in the front there. Over on the right, this is where you're going to see all your mugs and stuff. They haven't really changed the layout of the uh, store in a while, so you got your mugs in here. You've got all your cups and tumblers, and this is all your latest inventory. So you've got your Lumiere on top, and you've got the different little jars and stuff you can choose from. So anything new that you're looking at to buy, it's usually in the front of any general store or any store that you walk in, any of the shops. So over on the right hand side, as you're walking in, it's a general store also. So this store actually doubles as a shop slash general store. I'll give you a little pan around here to see what you guys are looking at. They got a lot of inventory in here. As you're walking into the left, you've got the shirts, the most recent inventory they're putting out there so they give you the ideas that are all the new stuff. So you don't gotta go trying to walk around the store and find it. But we'll continue on in here. Over at the general store, you've got anything from the bananas we just passed. You've got wines, you've got foods, just about anything you're looking for. Ice creams, they've got the quick stop and go with the ice cream, pick something up and leave. And this is really themed out nicely. I like the carpeting on the floor. It looks like it's tile all the way through, but it's actually carpeting. And then you got some stuff over here to take a peek at. It looks like you've got some, the princesses over here to choose from. And everything's pretty much set up in little sections. If you guys can kind of notice, you've got the, the stuffed animals, you've got the books, you've got the shoes, you've got the bathing suit and swimming section. In the back here, they've got what they had now have for all the shirts and stuff. I'm not a fan of the way they do the shirts. They've got them all on the wall and you choose your shirt. And to me, it feels like it's a mass produced item and it doesn't feel that. And granted, everything is, but I like to have it where I go and I find my shirt, not like go up on the wall, pick number A, go in slot A, and then uh, here we go. Now we got it. All right. And I should say pick letter A, not number A. Put another pin around there. Got your little Minnie Mouse stuff going on right here. Up in the middle, you got Goofy there up on a ladder going in that the old stove flue pipe there. And today I'm with Morgan and I'm with Marley. You want to say hi, Marley? Yeah. All right, and we're looking around, seeing what we can find today. A lot of times we'll be in here doing the, uh, the shoots, and as we're shooting, we're actually shopping anyway. We actually come in to shop and shoot. And you guys are gonna see Morgan and Marley probably coming and going during the video. They're popping in and out looking for what they're looking for too. So keep your eyes open. And that's another entrance that comes in from the side here. And that's one of the uh, Riverside shirts right there. There's another one down here. Get a little view of that. And this is where they keep most of the merchandise for the Riverside. They keep in the back corner. So as you're getting ready to leave in that back door there, this is where most of the merchandise is. And you can actually go outside and they've got the mannequins. You can look through the window and see what they have on uh, display. I usually just walk around the store. See what they have in there. Some of the Tron stuff there it looks like. Here comes Morgan and Marley again. And there's some shirts over here. You got another t-shirt section. They had one on the other wall. And they also have one over here. So sometimes they'll have new inventory, sometimes they'll have other inventory in there, sometimes they just have extra of other things. That's a nice little uh, backpack there. I just got the new Peter Pan one. I really like that one, so I got my wife to Peter Pan. And there's Goofy up on the old pipe there. Now technically you wouldn't have to do that, but it actually looks really nice with that stuff going back and forth up there. It gives it a little bit more uh, effect and makes it more, I don't know, more Disney-ish. This is the stuff that I like about Disney, is the way they theme everything and make it look nice. Another 50. 
backpack there. Not a fan of that style. Donald Duck up there. Looks like Huey, Dewey, and Louie. This is the little things that Disney does that really makes it come together as a nice store. And it just brings the magic into this type of place where you want to keep coming back, coming back. Like, I can literally be visiting and still I want to come over. I'll go out of the way to come over and drive into these places just because I like to see what they got in there. Certain stores aren't that way this is. And there's some more apparel over here, guys. And they've got some low end and they've got some high end. So bring your pocketbooks, guys. Bring your wallets also. And they still, you know, they still have deals on different things. So keep your eyes open. They do have sections every now and then where you can get things that are a little better priced if you guys are on a budget. And you can also go out and spend 200 bucks on a shirt. I've seen stuff like 160 bucks for a shirt, the Tommy Bahama stuff. There's some more of the stuff the general store offers right there. So once again, this is one of my favorite stores. This is the Fulton General Store, and this is over here at the Port Orleans Riverside, guys. So if you guys are on property, I do urge you to come on over and take a peek at this one. This is one of my favorites, like I said. It's, it's definitely worth the experience to come over and take a look and even walk around the resort. And that's it. See you guys on the next one.